check the mic and make sure it sound right boys what is going on traders i hope you guys are having an amazing day thank you for being here if you are here for the first time please do not forget to smash that like button and subscribe to this channel so today we are talking about palantir technologies i know it has been a while since i did any type of technical analysis or even fundamentals regarding palantir technologies but today i have a reason why i am talking about pltr with that let's get started so right now palantir technology is trading at 24 dollars 58 cents for those of you wondering if i sold any shares of palantir i haven't i still have my 400 shares actually my total return is at two thousand two hundred dollars that is about a 29 percent return and moreover i purchased 12 contracts that are expiring next week a 25 dollar and 50 cents call option overall when we see palantir it actually has been doing pretty good only today it is up by 1.84 percent in the last one week it is up by 2.3 percent and in the last one month it is up by 28 percent when i bought palantir actually averaged down my average cost became around 19 dollars from that we're up almost by 29 percent in the last one month so moving forward i see palantir reaching 30 dollars sooner than we expected and i want to also talk about upcoming catalysts that can potentially push palantir to reach that 30 dollars mark even higher than that so the first thing is the russell 3000 inclusion on this file all the companies that are going to be added on russell 3000 and one of them will be palantir technologies this is going to be on june 25th which is going to be in two weeks i'm happy that palantir is included in this index fund but at the end of the day there are a lot of other companies in this index fund it's not like some special inclusion where you're added an s p 500 or something like that but still that inflow coming to palantir it's a pretty good deal i know it's not going to be a lot of inflow but on average it's going to be around two billion dollars and the second thing i want to highlight is the chart in the past few months palantir has been consistently creating lower lows and lower highs but now for the last one month it has been consistently creating higher highs and higher lows and today we actually broke that 24 dollars and securing our position above 24 dollars right now we're trading at 24 dollars and 60 cents the last one minute chart you guys can see there is a massive volume coming in this might be from exercising options so trading above that 24 dollars and staying above that it is just the beginning for palantir i personally believe palantir has a potential to get back to 30 dollars and in the previous video when we discussed that palantir actually left a gap at this strike price around 29 30 dollars and this might be the time where palantir is going to get back there and fill that gap so keep that in mind and i have a reason why i am saying that so the second confirmation for me is going to be around 26 dollars breaking that strong resistance area and finally reaching that 27 dollars and eventually trading above 30 dollars the reason behind it is gamma squeeze the gamma squeeze happens when the underlying stock price begins to go up very quickly within a short period of time as more money flows into a call options for investors that forces more buying activity which can lead to higher stock prices so i have talked about this for tattooed shave amc a lot of other stocks on my previous videos and now palantir can potentially be in that range for example if we go to bar chart and see the options open interest for palantir expiring next week on the 18th the 30 dollars strike price is at 65,000 open interest i don't want to even consider that but i can talk about the 25 dollar the 26 dollar the 20 dollars 24 dollar and 22 dollar 23 dollar all this open interest can easily be in the money because most of them already are if you add 25 plus 17 that will give you around 42 and if you add another 14 on top of that that will give you around 56 plus another 14 that will give you around 70,000 contracts that can potentially be in the money next week this is without including the $30 strike price the $25 strike price and the $26 strike price based on the momentum that we're having we can potentially trade above even 25 and 26 dollars this most likely will create a major gamma squeeze because we're gonna be having at least 100,000 open interest if we traded above 26 dollars keep that in mind so each options represent 100 contracts when you multiply 100,000 by 100 
that would give you about 10 million shares only because of calls being in the money for example today the average volume for palantir is usually about 59 million and today's volume is about 29 million so 10 million shares is not a small amount we didn't even put into consideration that potential buyers for next week and on top of that more and more institutional investors are buying into the stock 724 total initial owners you guys remember when i make a video when this number was at 300 400 500 now we are at 724 that is massive they are actually building a very strong foundation and last but not the least i want to highlight this article i'm sure by now most of you read it palantir is sandbagging growth projection this is palantir's projection by 2025 to have a revenue of four billion dollars but now most people are expecting Palantir to grow by 30% only. So 2021, they have about $800 million in revenue. If they kept growing by 30%, by 2025, their revenue will be $2.3 billion. So they have to grow more than 30% to actually achieve that goal of $4 billion. So even if they grow by 40%, still they wouldn't make it. They have to grow about 40%, actually by 50%. To reach that 3.9 to 4 billion dollars in revenue every year growing by 50 percent and the next four years they're expecting a growth by 200 percent today palantir is trading at 24 dollars and in 2025 with 30 percent growth has to be at least 69 to 70 dollars and if they grow by 40 percent 2025 the stock price will be at 92 dollars if they grow by 50 percent the stock price will be at 122 dollars Actually, I personally believe we're going to see Palantir trading above $30 very soon. You guys can come back and read this article so that you can get a different perspective and a different outlook where Palantir can potentially be heading. So the reason I mentioned today Palantir reaching that $30 even higher than that is not because of fundamentals. I know the fundamentals of this company is very strong and actually stronger than ever been. And they have been continuously to invest in different specs and expanding their diversification that is pretty good just keep it on your watch list this is not a financial advice i'm just giving you my opinion i might be wrong i might be right but please let me know what you think about this in the comment section below i would love to hear about it thank you for watching i'll see you on my upcoming videos It sound right, boy.